Hello everyone, welcome again to our YouTube channel. My name as usual is Daniel from the Okema Embai. In our video today, I want us to discuss about a question which was put forward from one of you viewers that are you allowed to take your medical examination from any other hospital other than the one that has been instructed uh, from the embassy? The answer is no. When you receive your second notification, that's uh, your 2NL, the instructions will be very clear that there will be a link that will be provided in that 2NL telling you that you need to book for your medical examination in this facility. You are not allowed to take in, uh, your examination from another facility rather than the one that has been instructed or that has been given. And in most cases, for those ones who are from, uh, say, Kenya, you must take your medical examination from IOM, situated in Nairobi. So that's the only facility, the DV lottery processes and other visa processes allow members to visit before they travel to the United States, before they move to the UK, before they move to Australia, and you also meet people there going to Canada and many other countries that require that you have to take a medical exam before you travel. So IOM is internationally recognized facility that offers those medical exams and it's like they have a, 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 an agreement with them that they have to do this and this. They have specific instructions and they have confidence with them that whatever that they will give as a medical exam from the physician and doctor is final. So guys, do not be cheated that you can take medical examinations for DV lottery, for example, in our case, from another hospital. You have to book your medical examinations from IOM. When you receive your second notification, you will be given a link on how you can contact IOM and book your medical examination. They have like a linkage between them and the embassy. Once you provide them with your date of your interview, they obviously know when they can slot you in for the medical examination and they normally do the medical examination a date close to the time you are going for your uh, visa interview. So be aware about it. Side that do not mix up facts, do not mix up issues, and then you end up being sent again to do medical examination from IOM in case you did your medical examination from any other facility apart from the one provided. So guys, get it clear. You can also, in this case, have some vaccines elsewhere and provide records. They allow that. But examination, like the chest x-ray and other physical examination must be done by the IOM medical uh, personnel. So get that one before you go for your medicals and before you go for your visa interviews. So guys, I hope I've tried to answer that question which was put forward sometimes back asking, are you allowed to take your medical examination from another facility apart from the one provided in your second notification letter. So I've tried to say it's no. You have to take your medical examinations from the facility as it is instructed in your second notification. Thank you guys for watching. Encourage more members to come on board. Let's share our videos. And for the new subscribers, thank you. And you will enjoy here. We work as a family. We give each other advice. We support one another. And then... We hope that as the souls will be out,
we'll have so many majority members coming from this group. Thank you and may God bless you all.